Hey, what's up everybody? Ray Ray here, and today we're going to try out a game called Payout. It's a shop simulator. The developer contacted me through email to give this game a shot, get it some exposure, and we're going to dive right into it. Go ahead and hit New Game before we go into the settings. I'm sure there will be some changes that we do need to make in the options, but we got to know what those are first. Uh, your save name. Ray... Not Ray Ra, it's Ray Ray. And, uh, well, it just throws us right in here. We got $4,000. The sensitivity does need to go down a little bit. Let's try that. I'm not a gamer, so to speak. So, uh, I'm not very good with a mouse. So it doesn't seem there's a tutorial just yet. Those are probably people waiting to come in. Let's see. We've got some boxes over here. I'm sure. No, this is very early stages. The game was just released 10 days ago. Uh, last update I seen when I just installed it was uh, seven hours ago. So he's pretty active. I think I want to turn this down just a little bit more. Uh, there's no music yet. Sound effects aren't too loud. Let's see. Lift mouse button is pick up. E is open box. Oh, we got some beer. Okay, so now, okay, I see we can carry, what, what is that over there? Is that four items? Let's see. Let's hold right mouse button and then click. Oh, okay. Well, that's, that works. All right, there we go. Or can you pick up a whole box at a time? No. Okay, so we gotta do one at a time. Here. Wow, y'all are thirsty. Well, I'm probably sold out already. My wife is calling. Hang on one second, please. I am back. My apologies. My wife always calls me on lunch, but I cut out all that part. So, two customers are waiting to check out. Is it these guys? Okay. So. Okay, let's streamline. I think I'm still a little too fast on my mouse. Alright, so is there like an open or a close? Oh, shoot. I'm stuck. Okay. Do I click it? Anything? Oh, I see. Huh. Alright, so I wonder if I can close the doors uh, to get some of this stuff put out. Let's see. This is gonna, oh, I've got to get used to the controls here. So click to pick up, then we'll see them right here. All right, so you don't have to be too close. It's in this box, one customer is waiting to check out. Man, this is a pretty fast pace. And no shortage of customers. The uh, graphics, uh, the other series that'll play, Rise of Gun, which I need to make a video on it. It's been updated uh, pretty decently here lately. Uh, it's, got a, it's got a similar feel, similar feel and similar look. Hope that ain't too loud. So that's all of those. Is this the same stuff? He opens. No, it's different. Does it say what they are? Oh, okay, I see over there. Manage T tasks. We'll have to look at that and see what that is. Build order. Man, it sells so much quicker. It looks like it's a pretty big world out there we'll definitely explore that we're going to sell out all of our stuff here might as well i wonder if you can get like a uh, talent points or you know upgrade your character how how you can get a capacity or a force the max that you can get can we get somebody to do this for us i reckon I wonder what I'll do with the empty boxes. Is there a garbage can? Is there a dumpster? 
Hmm. Oh, oh, okay. Right there. Yeah. We'll see as soon as we get these customers out of the way. If that's what that garbage can over there is. Let's see. Pick up object. Okay. There we go. What's this? Oh, like a little little storage place back here. It looks like my bathroom downstairs. Oh, I'm coming. Seems pretty be a uh, pretty good variety of uh, characters too. Uh, how you customers look. Am I sold out? No. I mean, the decisions ain't that hard there. There you go. I, I love games like this. I absolutely adore them. It's, uh, a lot of times you're basically playing the same game. Did he just get three and there was only two? Anywho. Uh, a lot of them's the same, you know, as far as the, uh, the concept goes, stuff like that. But, uh, it's always fun to just start out, boot yourself up. I think that van is fun. But yeah, most of this stuff right now, you know, you guys watching this, don't pay a whole lot of attention to uh, whether it be uh, bugs or just how everything is laid out and how everything works because this is very, very early and the developer needs uh, this kind of stuff for the feedback. So let's see, sell products. Okay. Order boxes at once. Let's see, spend money, earn money. Okay, can we hit escape on that? What's uh, build? Okay. We can get fridge, small fridges, uh, another register, a warehouse, do some decorating. I wonder how we can expand our shop. And do the decorations give any bonuses or any type of stuff? I wonder if our trash can eventually gets full. Okay, what about manage? Inner shop name. Oh, I ain't done that yet. Oh, shoot. Let's see. Ray Rays. Okay, and I guess that's where you... Okay. Well, yeah. Well, yeah. Unlock land. Oh. Let's start the next day. So our time, time does move pretty quick. It's up there. Let's see. Let's go back to manage. Oh, workers. Here we go. So we just, uh, with the restocker, know where to put a certain product. First place one on the chosen shelf. The restocker will then fill this part of the shelf. Well, that's easy. Hmm. should not been that simple in other games. Manage prices. Okay, we don't have anything just yet. Oh, so you got to get license. We got drinks. We still need the uh, alcohol and food. All that stuff. Okay. It's, uh, it doesn't seem like there is a day and night. Uh, I was in Fairbanks, Alaska, visiting my daughter a couple months ago. And it was the time of year. Was, uh, you really had to pay attention to the clock because I think they had like 22 hours of daylight at the time. Uh, the sun would uh, dip under the horizon about 2 a.m. and come right back up at 4. But if you wasn't really paying attention, it would uh, it'd be midnight and you wouldn't even know it. Okay. Is there, can we change the camera angle on this, or is that just first person? Oh, excuse me, hey, is that mine too? How can I get out? Let's be on top of it. Oh, unlock, how much? 10,000. All right, let's go, uh, let's go look around the city for a second. There's a bus stop. What's this stuff? Furniture market. Is there? Can we buy stuff out of this? You think, or we'll be able to eventually? I'm sure. It's not highlighting anything at the moment. No. No. A lot of this stuff is probably not going to be implemented yet. That's not where I came in at. It's right here. There is nobody home. So nothing's coming up on the mouse. All right. See anything else interesting? Yeah, there's their 
there's stuff. So it's down this way. Dumpster, garbage can. Kind of looks like my little town. It's uh, very historic. Uh, a lot of little things. They got the city dressed up real nice and all that stuff that's up here. Boom. This little camp spot. What do we got here, boys? It's like a little army outpost or something. Got some pumpkins. Nobody around. This, uh, the graphic style, though, is, is cute. I wonder if uh, I'm going to stay with that or... Uh-oh, I'm going to have to back out of here. I can't see. No mirrors, no nothing. It's, oh, B, change camera. <laughs> All right, you genius. But it's, uh, it's cute. You know, the uh, polygon style. Don't get me wrong, I like a good looking game, but at the same time, if it's not going to be realistic to a point, then I'd just rather it uh, be like this. What is this? Okay. Let's see what we got down here. Is that, yeah, that road goes down there, doesn't it? Just want to get out here doing this stuff and not really play the game a whole lot. This must be like some type of arm base or something. I wonder if the developer was uh, in the service. Or, you know, if he can enlighten us up a little bit uh, where this takes place. Uh, you know, of course, I'm going to email the developer about this video. Let him know it's posted. And also, I'm sure people will be wondering if it's going to be available on Steam. Uh, if you don't care, uh, just a, a simple comment will work. You know, just comment if it's going to be available on Steam. Uh, or you can just uh, let me know, and I'll update the description or put it in the comments. But just a simple comment would be just fine. What's that? Shift around. Oh, yeah. Oh, man. Can't unlock that. Forklift. Okay. Oh, I can unlock it, though. Huh. So I can actually do stuff around here. Okay. Daily stats coming soon. Oh, it's 7 a.m. Oh, geez. Price changes. So cereals went down. Okay, I don't have... Wow, so you can actually... It's not just a uh, grocery store. There's a lot of other stuff. Seems like we probably need to make an order. There's a hospital. Cute little church. Let's see, I gotta get my camera back here. A little farm. I'll suck at driving. Ooh, man, there's all kinds of stuff back here. What's all that back there? Let's go. Go have a peek see there. So I guess there's like no fuel, no nothing like that. Can we go in the convenience store? It's funny how it puts me out on top of the van. Let's see. Anything in here? No. Nothing going on. Nobody home. Okay. See how far out this goes. Uh, it'd be nice if the uh, camera angle stays too. Go to the rock in the road there. Oh shoot! I tell you what, this thing turns on a dime. Okay, so it goes down there. This might be uh, plans for a later thing. Off 
So, sir, I haven't dropped a drink. Let's see. Now, if I can try to find my way back. Do the bus stops work? And if they do, where else would you possibly need to go? Okay. I'm getting the vibes here that this is going to be more than just a shop style simulator. It should be more of a uh, immersive uh, thing, kind of like they're trying to do with dealer simulator, uh, stuff like that. Let's see, just a little straight one out that way. It's just different. Uh, there's car lots. Can you buy vehicles at the moment? Repair place. Um, no, it doesn't seem like it. What about this? No. But it is here. Oh, that's nice. Look at that 69 Camaro there. Alrighty, let's, uh, let's go back to our shop. I think we need to order some stuff. We'll actually play the part of the game that's supposed to be played right now after having a look around the map now. Where the hell is my shop? I think it's back up here. Is it right here on the left? Yeah, I see it back there. Oh, who put that there? Okay. Park, we do need to order some stuff, so... Let's see. Okay, what all can we get right now? So just drinks is all we can get. Wow, tools, other. Hmm. Get some toilet paper. Some mouthwash. Uh, we'll just get a case of each, I guess. $654. Uh, you do get discounts for buying more box. The order is waiting for you at the warehouse. Okay. Is there a map? Where's the warehouse? Oh, is it back here? I think that's just my little storage thing. Was it the place where the forklift was? It's the only thing I was seeing that I would call a warehouse. Hey, arcade. I wonder if anything in there is going to be implemented. Just please, please, the biggest peep in Rise of Gun is for some reason they've got a food thing in there. I don't know why, but it doesn't make a lot of sense. Let's, let's try to keep that from happening. So where was the warehouse? I thought it was down this way. Actually, I went through a back road to get there, so it's not here. Okay, that's just houses around there. I'm telling you, it was down that back way. I passed it up somewhere. Because it wasn't. I don't think it was that far. Is that it up there? that the warehouse? I don't think those boxes was there earlier. Let's see. It looks like a warehouse, doesn't it? Oh, oh yeah, I can. Okay, so these... Okay, that's my stuff. there oh wow let's try that good enough so does this open well let's see pick up object place yeah the whole hold in right and then left click is new uh, I'm not familiar with it 
No, oh, where's my van? But it does work. I mean, it's uh, it's actually smooth. I keep turning too quick still. I wonder if I can cram all these in there. It's going to be close. Man, I can be a good ways away. Oh, no. Come on. Oh. Can, I, can I push them back? Maybe if I stand right here. There we go. More than one way to skin a cat. Yeah. Now, I'll see if I can find exactly where my shop was at. Oh, uh, you know what? I think I just went past it the first time because this looks, it should be right here, right? Yeah, how in the world did I pass that up the first time? Oh, uh, well, yeah, it's, that looks good right there. So, let's get this in here. Hey, how much was workers? See, we'll get this stuff out and then we'll start the next day. And, uh, I still got to turn that mouse sensitivity down a little bit. And then, uh, we'll get some workers. I could have put my van at the door. Maybe get another shelf. But if I do that, let's see. I'll put it over there. Oh man, you know what? I bet my shelf will be at the warehouse. <laughs> I'll get that with my next order. And last one. Right, let's see. Start the next day. Okay, so what was it? Manage? Yes, workers. Hire. Check out. I can do that. Let's put you on restocking. $10 per hour. That shouldn't be too bad, right? Okay, tasks. We got a task. Spend money. Oh, hey, big guy. Well, look at you. Them there. Put that there. So you just gotta put one on the shelf. And oh boy, here it other rest. Is that? It can't be that good, can it? It can't be that easy. Cause I played other games like Pumping Simulator, stuff like that. That would uh could really learn a lot from this. Oh, wait, I've got, uh, I'm closed. Okay, let's open that up. So I guess the workers cost initially $1,000 to hire, and then they're $10 an hour afterwards. Is it $1,000 a day? We'll see. Oh, I'm going to stand there until I come over here. Okay. Lock your hair. I think I need to turn the sound effects down just a little bit. Let's see. Let's try that. Whether or not there'll be any music, I don't know. Uh, I'm definitely going to stay updated as much as I can on this. Just to follow the progress. I wonder if I can get the, the licenses already. We 
we'll try to buy a license and stuff too to let's see where is that on manage license so can we okay so i guess we can i don't know everything that's implemented now so i guess we're good on money i don't know if we're gonna go broke what happens if you do or what And I wonder how you can expand the shop. What's this one back there? Is that the stuff that's left in the box? Okay. And I think I can set prices too. Okay. So it's basically uh, defaults just double, 100% uh, markup, which is pretty good. So I'll spend a thousand, make two thousand. Wonder if I can. Or somebody to go get my stuff for me. So I do have to say, having to drive all the way out to the warehouse is, uh, it's not ideal. But it works at the moment. Until something better can be put in place. So I can change their roles at any time. So I can actually, after he gets the shelves uh, stocked, I can put him as a cashier and go out and do some things. But this is pretty well going to be taking all day. We're already almost 4 o'clock. we got some hoochies in this game. Sailor Moon. It's a good idea how much we can sell today too in uh in one day. So I spent a thousand for the license and a thousand for the worker. Uh puts us a little over five thousand what we would have had, plus the, the hourly ten dollars an hour charge. Are you bored? So we could probably get another shelf, fill it up with the alcohol. It's hard to tell what time of year it is because you have this guy in the sweater. And then you had the hooker just walked in, hardly wearing anything. Oh, here comes another one. task so it is earn money that earned us money so sell brush sell products I wonder if these are random or they're set tasks called sell brush is there even a uh, thing would that be under tools or something I don't know
So I wonder if the shop closes on its own at a certain time. So we're at 10 o'clock. Well, I do have the option to start the next day already. TV for my boy over here. I don't know what's his name. I don't have a name. We'll call you Keith. I don't even know what I'm selling. Oh, that's toilet paper. I didn't uh, look at it. Let's see. Color energy drink, fruit, fruit juice, water. And then we had, what was the other one that we had? Well, an alcohol is just other. Okay, toilet paper, mouthwash. Oh, that this just cleaned me out. Sure did. All right. So, I think, guys, as of right now, that is the gist of it. I will probably play a couple more uh, episodes of this. Work on this a little bit. See what all is uh, available at the moment. See if we can expand uh, once we get to that point. Maybe buy some land. Uh, see how that affects our building. Because I know on the, uh, let's see, where was it at? Build, is it? Because on the build, uh, you have all of this stuff that you can add on to. So I just wonder how that will affect, you know, the walls and stuff. You know, we build out that way or however it goes. Uh, do we put a doorway in? Will it automatically take this wall out? all that stuff but uh yeah this is the gist of it it's a uh, very promising uh it's smooth i haven't encountered any bugs bugs i would say so to speak uh none that i've noticed uh, except for the voting floating van but that's not a bug there's going to be a lot of aesthetic things uh right now but hey it works at the moment oh there's two people there but let's see Make sure there's nothing else I want to look at. But I do believe that is it for right now, guys. Uh, we will revisit this. I will uh, try to do as many videos as I can as updates come out. But with my life and my time, it's not always a given. That'll be immediate. But I'll be as quick as I can about it. But guys, thank you all so much for watching.